The recipe creator provides you with valuable insights about your meals, recipes and menu items, including potential allergens, food labeling data, calorie content, cost proportion, and a breakdown of a recipe's nutritional information. To create a recipe, click the blue start button in the top left side of the screen and select new recipe. Provide a name and optional description in the boxes provided. These will act as keyword tags later when searching for your recipe. You will also need to select a category for your recipe. Search for your ingredients using the food search box in the top left corner of your screen. Click on the food for a quick breakdown, including calories, macronutrients and a quick summary of the food. Click on the eye symbol to view more information on that food. Once satisfied with the food, click the insert button to add the food to your recipe. Add the quantity of each ingredient by clicking the blank space in the quantity box. You can use our smart portions where available or type the quantity directly into the manual entry box. You can also tag custom data to any ingredient by clicking the custom fields box next to the smart portions. Here you can edit the quid for this food, add a country of origin, add a new custom field by clicking the new button. This is also useful for managing ingredient data such as shelf life or storage instructions. You can also add costing information to each ingredient if you're interested in calculating the recipe's cost proportion. Once a cost has been added for an ingredient, it will be stored for use when creating other recipes. Continue to add all other ingredients and sub-recipes. The analysis is performed in real time as you work. You can use the advanced search tool to filter by food category, database, or dietary requirements. This will narrow down your search results. If your ingredient is added as raw, you can increase the accuracy of your vitamin and mineral analysis by attaching a cooking method to each ingredient. You can also provide up to five portion size options for a recipe. Nutritics will automatically calculate the calories, cost, and or RP. You can then manually enter a sale price, a barcode or a product code. You can also enter the weight based on the calories. Once you've finished adding your portion sizes, you can scroll down to see the allergen information. Hovering over any active allergen will give you the contributing source. Nutritics will automatically indicate any nutritional claims relevant for the recipe. Select any nutrition claim you wish to use and any associated health claims. For more information on when and how to use the nutrition and health claims, click to request training here. Below this, you can see the quid information. You can also add any cooking instructions and notes to the recipe. The final section is the full nutrient breakdown per 100 grams. You can scroll up to see the food labeling section. This will show you the nutritional information for labeling. You can also enter the number of servings in your recipe here. You can edit the weight after cooking and add a weight change factor to the recipe in the modifiers and properties tab. You can also add the profit margin and the tax rate to calculate the ORP. If nutrition per 100 grams is required, you may need to specify the weight change factor. Accounting for water loss during cooking will make your recipe more nutrient dense per 100 grams, while the absorption of water during cooking will make it less nutrient dense. If you don't know the weight change factor of a dish, you can enter a percentage value to estimate the weight change. 
The grouping and sharing section allows you to group your recipes for easy access. All recipes appear in the drop down under the search box. You can also share recipes to other Nutritics users or Libro clients with viewing or editing access. You can upload a photo of your recipe directly from your computer by selecting the Browse button, or you can also click to enter the image URL. Once finished, you can create a PDF, email, or export your recipe to Excel. You can also create a shareable link for social media or publishing to your website via a live URL. The export settings allow you to customize what information is included on your recipe export. You can also generate labels from the Export to Label Maker button. If you have the Label Maker add-on, this will allow you to fully customize and create your labels. If you need further assistance, check out the user manual or email us at support at